Hey everyone, how are you guys? I am here because I have a package. If it does sound kind of different, I am in a different room. My boyfriend is actually sick and watching movies and you can kind of hear the TV through the other place that I usually film. Also, please disregard my nails. I am missing a few that popped off <laughs> and I will be gluing them back, just not at this moment. So. I recently got in this package. I picked this D stash box up off of Mercari. I talk about Mercari all the time. I'll leave it linked down below. It's a marketplace. You can find things for such a good deal. This seller was selling this entire D stash box for 20 bucks. So I got this for I think $28 after shipping, but I'm so excited because there's tons of stuff in here. Oh, also if you are curious, my press-ons are from Kiss and they usually last a really long time. I was just in a rush and I didn't do them right. This box was such a good deal, I couldn't pass it up, so let's jump right into it. So first things first are these huge, look how big these are. These are apparently correction tape, and um, I think they're just brand new, four brand new correction tapes. So big, but you guys can kind of see the color of it is slightly off-white which is so interesting to me. So let me just grab a little notebook here and um, let me just test this out. I'm not sure if it's supposed to maybe match like different type of paper, but this is pretty white. So let's see how this looks. Oops, I'm not doing that right. Yeah, it's pretty, it's definitely more yellow in person. Um, than it is showing up on camera. But regardless, I think it's nice to have just in case I have a paper this color. And I think this is actually too yellow for even the Hobonichi Weeks uh, planner, but I don't know, I can test it out later. But yeah, four of these, which is amazing because that is a lot of correction tape. And then I think these are ink cartridges. And yeah, so they included a, a Koiko collection fountain pen, which if I'm gonna be totally honest with you guys, I have never in my life used a correction pen. So let me move this out of the way and shall we zoom in a little bit more? I don't know if there's ink in this already. Let me see. Oh, there is, oh my gosh, yeah. This is a purple ink. I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a bluish purple. And wow, this is really nice. I don't know, I've never heard of this brand. I know nothing about fountain pens. So, my, yeah, that is smooth. So I gotta look this up. Koweko, Koweko collection it's super tiny and i love that because it's gonna be great for travel so she included some of these cartridges i'm assuming that fit this fountain pen so this is the same brand as the pen koweko this one is midnight blue oh and they're made in germany um this is another one here oh midnight blue maybe that's this color because this is definitely a bluish shade so those might be midnight blue and then we have blue black as well. Wait, do you get six of them in here? I'm so confused. I've never, again, had any experience with fountain pens. I thought you had to refill them in a certain way, but maybe these are refillable cartridges. So just because it's a mini one. So that is really cool. I think that is so cool and I'm gonna figure that out later. But yeah, so that also came in the package and then Y'all, this is what I'm most excited about is the D-Stash. Let me just dump this out really quick. Okay, zoom you guys out a little bit here. All right, so open this up. She included a planner, which I'm so excited about, and you guys are gonna understand why in just a second because, y'all, she was de-stashing the Hobonichi 2024 Hon A5. So the Hon in the Hobonichi planners this year, I think is new, and it is a harder bound cover. 
and it's the cousin, which I know you're probably like, this is kind of crazy. You already have a Hobonichi cousin, the original um, with the paper yellow cover. But it, th I mean, this was part of the D-Stash. Again, all of this for $20. So what I just showed you, this planner, and then all of her leftovers, which I will get to in a second. So she actually um, decorated this hone already. Some of these are bent probably from shipping, which is totally okay. So let's see what she did to it. Um, I know there's a lot of blank pages, but some of them are written in. So here she put in some vinyls, it looks like. Cute. She put in these uh, year at a glance stickers. And I know she used a few pages. Okay, so look at that. She whited that out. So that's what the whiteout looks like. Um, this one on the Hobonichi cousin paper. What is this paper called? The Tome of Rubber paper, that's what it is. And then it looks like, okay, she used, which monthly is this? Okay, this is December monthly, which she taped. Um, and then this is the January monthly that she started, which is totally fine. Um, and then everything else, oh, there's some a few stickers here and there. Let's go to the weekly. I don't think she did anything in the weekly or the daily. Yeah, y'all, this is a pretty new planner. And now I'm kind of like, I don't know what to do with this planner now. Cause this is kind of like an, oh my gosh. She put in a piece of vellum. <gasps> Ooh, I might have to take this out <laughs> and save this somehow. How did she put this in? Probably with just washi. <gasps> I love this vellum, oh my gosh. So yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this yet. I'm gonna figure something out what to do with this because now I have an entirely other Hobonichi cousin. And I love this because this is the cat cover that I have on my Hobonichi Weeks, if you've been watching my videos. And if you, is this a mark? Oh wait, no, that's a ball of yarn. I was like, what's that? Okay, so yeah, really cool. Again, great deal. And then, this y'all we have two chunks of planner sticker leftovers yes it's i i was shocked when i saw that she was including all of these leftovers so i kind of just want to quickly flip through them um i think they're all coffee monsters co but we're about to find out now so this clearly was some washi leftovers. Oh my gosh, these are full sheets. Oh my gosh, wait, are these leftovers? Okay, I'm so confused. All right, I'm gonna put leftovers here and then just, you know, all right, I'm just gonna flip through just to show you guys kind of what we have here. So tons of full washi, holy crap. Oh my gosh. Hold on, let me put it this way so it's easier for you guys to see. This was clearly the January monthly. Oh my gosh, she didn't even use these. No way. Wait a minute. I think I bought these too, so I might have to figure out what to do with all of these. Oh my goodness, you guys. All right, these look like strips from last year's monthlies. <gasps> Tons of functional usable things here. I'll totally still use those. Oh my gosh, wow. So she definitely hooked it up with her leftovers. Um, the, all of these seem like true leftovers, um, but again, lots of functional things I can still use. Look at all that, all those boxes. Uh, okay, oh, and it's by month. So here's the February. This is brand new. She didn't use this at all, look at that. Oh, there's still some washi, I love that. I can definitely, definitely make some spreads out of these. I was actually gonna buy these monthlies because I didn't get them last year because I wasn't in a Hobonichi, but now I have leftovers. <gasps> yes, okay. Oh my goodness. Y'all, I'm so excited, this is March. As you can see that we are in, there's tons of sheets here. I could, wait, some of them are repeated. Look at this. 
Oh my gosh. Anyway, um, oh wait, some another March monthly. This was might be the year prior. Oh my gosh. I am so glad I got this D stash. Like I grabbed it once I saw her post. I had no idea it would include all of this. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Look, wow. It's literally every month. So April, there's two different April monthlies. Washi, love that. Okay. Oh my goodness. Y'all, this was such a good deal. I'm telling you guys, if you're not on Mercari, sign up because you can find some amazing deals. 20 bucks for all these leftovers and a planner and correction tape and a fountain pen and ink. It's insane. Okay, this has to be 2022 maybe leftovers because I don't recognize this. Oh my gosh, so cute. Okay, yeah, this one's 2023, I can tell. Oh my goodness. You guys don't know how excited I am because I've been wanting to place a big order on the Coffee Monsters Co. And I've just been stopping myself because I don't need to be spending hundreds of dollars on stickers. So this truly is a godsend. Um, I'm so excited about this. It's just, oh, it's so good. All right, what month are we on now? Oh, August, we're in August. Beautiful summer colors. Mm -hmm. September. I love how she kept them in all like in like order. That's amazing. I don't have to do any thinking. October. Yeah, I mean, just with little bits and pieces, you can definitely make a full spread. November. And she didn't use any of these icons. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. I know she doesn't watch my videos, but I am so grateful. And think, oh, this is brand new. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Y'all, I'm so hyped, I'm so excited. All right, so these were all monthlies. Um, I was trying to flip through that pretty fast because look, look how thick that is. And then we have another chunk, probably just as thick. So let's see what should we have here. Oh my gosh, these are kits. So these were monthly kits here. And then we're gonna go into weekly kits. So um, let's see, lots of habit trackers. Those are great to use and the arrows. Um, I don't know what kits these are from. A new chapter. Okay, so they're mostly together, I think. It looks like, oh my gosh. This is amazing. Oh, look, some full boxes. It looks like she, has a few of this of the same kit, which is amazing. Um, Happy Mail uh, weekly kit. Oh, y'all, this is, I'm sorry, but this was so worth it. Back to school kit, so worth it. Oh, the Lunar New Year kit. Oh, and there's still some full boxes. So I'm definitely gonna be using all of these leftovers in my Hobonichi cousin. I think it's a fun to see how people use leftovers anyway. Oh, she had two of these. This is basically a full kit. <laughs> uh, more happy mail, which is nice. A gloomy week. I actually have this kit. I have this full kit. Um, the birthday kit. Look at that. Full sheet. Oh my gosh, and all of these still have the beans. Wait, not all of them. Wait, but some of them still have the beans. So if you guys don't know her rewards program, um, you can collect these beans on a card and then you get a freebie. So I'm surprised she still left her beans on here. These little stickers. Anyway, regardless, again, grateful. I'm so happy. I don't really have to buy kits um, for a while. So this was Lucky Charms. This one's pretty used, but still stuff to work with. <gasps> This is like, oh my gosh. Again, it's basically like the full thing. Throw in some washi tape and I'm good to go. Yeah, cause she used the washi, which is totally fine. Um, 
I have just so much to work with. Okay, the Desert Storm. Okay, not much left there. We have Out of the Woods. This one's cute. I really like these little headers. Okay, Out of the Woods. Here's that deco. Oh, cute. Look how cute. Okay, A New Day. Oh my gosh, love it. So much left. These leftovers are amazing. So thank you to the seller again. She, I've purchased several things from her. She has such amazing deals on her listings. And I'm grateful because, oh my gosh. Like it's insane. $20 for all of this is insane because one sticker sheet is typically three dollars one sticker sheet and and the kids yeah it's three something per sheet and she gave me all of these leftovers oh my gosh amazing oh this is pretty spring adventures oh look at the summer kit oh my gosh i love this oh this is cute i was this was in my cart i was going to buy this and now I don't need to because I have washi tape that will go with this and now I can just pull in um, other things to make a whole kit. So yeah, amazing. I'm again, so happy with this purchase. Y'all, oh my gosh, this is the Valentine's Day one. Really happy about this and I again, I don't need to buy kits for quite a while and I, I I just thought this was such an amazing deal. There's just no other deal that's better than this one. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this random D-Stash haul. I'm linking Mercari down below. You won't regret it if you sign up. <laughs> Be careful though, because it's easy to spend a lot of money because you find so many good deals. All right, that's it for today, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.